Good morning, everyone. It's Thursday, the 26th of September. Barry here with you, signing on for another day. It's coming up at 7 o'clock. Well, it has come up to 7 o'clock. And today I'd like to recap on showing respect and not arguing with people when they make decisions for us, especially on budgeting and healthy eating. It's okay to have a treat every now and again, but guys, please don't waste your money on things that are not healthy for us. It is okay to have fish and chips and whatever, but you know, you've got, we've got to look after our bodies and make sure that we're not making ourselves sick by putting the wrong fuel into our body. Because it's like a car. If you put the wrong fuel in, our, in your car, the car will not go as well or function as well. So, if you're out in the belt and you want something healthy, pick a salad box or make a sandwich from home or, or anything like that. If you want fish and chips, that is perfectly okay but once in a while, but not every week because you are putting on weight by eating too much fat and if you eat too much of a bad thing, okay, you put on lots of weight. But if, <laughs> but if you eat too much of a good thing, okay, you, you're losing weight. So with the budgeting side of things, guys, if you want to have takeaway, set some money aside like $10 or $20 for a steak or something as a treat. But guys, don't throw your money down the drain by eating unhealthy stuff all the time. And this is what we discussed. Uh, yesterday on the show um, and it is important to look after our bodies because like I've just mentioned take away food all the time it's not good uh, take some healthy sandwiches okay or a wrap or salad box because it is coming into the warmer months now and we are into the warmer months and as you've noticed the days are getting longer and that is a, a sign that daylight saving is on the way which is a good thing and the days are getting longer and the nights are getting shorter so when daylight saving comes, it means that you that you can have a barbecue with your mates, play beach volleyball down at the beach, uh, play beach cricket, um, go for fish and chips and salad, and say go for a walk in the promenade down the promenade, even a do why or go and have dinner down at one of the beaches and you can even take the dog for a walk so as you've noticed in the morning it is getting lighter it was light when I woke up this morning and what a great feeling it was the time is coming up to five minutes past seven o'clock here. Um, the question I'd like to ask, are we getting enough rain? Probably not. 
Alabama is getting enough rain? Probably not. Let me know down below what, what you think we should do to help those poor farmers in the drought stricken areas of the state because if we don't get any rain soon guys we're going to end up with no drinking water because as you've been hearing in the news or on the news I should say parts of the state are in drought and that's no good so the advice I'd like to give is don't water your garden don't wash your car because you are wasting water by using a hose take your car down to a car wash and get the professionals to do it for you also don't use 40 liters of water when washing the dishes use a dishwasher and save 40 liters of water and have uh, and and have a shorter shower too think of the poor farmers out there it's time to draw this early morning show to a close it is coming up to 10 minutes past 7 o'clock and before I do go today the question I'd like to ask what are you going to have for breakfast are you gonna have some wheat bix with some fruit on the top some muesli or some porridge or some diced up fruit let me know down below and what are you gonna have for lunch are you gonna have a salad box a wrap salad sandwich for lunch or some greasy beef and chips the choice is up to you but for the moment it's time for me to say good morning to you youtube watchers now and from myself Barry Fair it is time for me to go thanks for waking up with me this morning and I will catch up with you later on but for the moment it's good morning